the Bible tells us, that all of the divine qualities of God, his truth, his love, his perfect, uh, perfection, his eternity, his knowledge, he wrapped those up in a little package and he sent it down to earth. And that's what we celebrate at Christmas time because Jesus came to earth and he was born in a manger and he was wrapped in swaddling clothes, diapers, and he was placed in uh, a cattle feeding trough in a stable in Bethlehem. So there we just set that right down there to uh, remind us that uh, Jesus came to earth. He wrapped up all of God's attributes into one package so that we could see him. Now the second part of the trick is this picture. And the picture I brought from my house, isn't that a beautiful picture? <laughs> Somebody said, something's missing in this picture. Well, this actually is a picture. What's missing? Color. Color. There's some color missing. You see, this is a, a picture that represents us all as human beings because the, the Bible tells us that God created man in the image of God. And so we are supposed to be a picture of God. And people should be able to look at us and see the righteousness and the holiness and the love and the goodness and the kindness of God. But a lot of people look at us, and what they see is kind of a, a distortion that's not very pretty. Because we have fallen away from God. And falling away from God and not doing what he tells us is called sin. So there's the problem of sin, because man has turned his back on God. But that is exactly why Jesus came from heaven to earth. Because he not only was born and laid in a manger, but he grew up and he taught. And as he taught, there were some people that didn't like his teaching because he said, I am the only way for you to come to God. He said, I will forgive your sins. And if you do not receive me and trust me and believe in me, then you will remain in your sins. And so they killed him. And after they killed him, they wrapped him up in grave cloths. So now we have here the grave cloths wrapping up God himself in the flesh. But you know, if, if Jesus is the creator of life, is it possible that he could stay dead in a grave? And you all know that at Easter time we celebrate the resurrection of Jesus because you see when Jesus was raised from the dead, they went to the tomb and they found something in the tomb. What did they find? They found the grave clothes. Jesus was not there. He had risen. And why had he risen? Because he wanted to give back to us the beauty and the color of God in his image. And as we receive Christ and trust in him and believe in him and give him our lives, he gives us his life. And he makes it possible for us to spend eternity with him. And so that's uh, one of the things that we remember as we think about why Jesus came to earth.